Oh yeah, I always wonder what it would be like to uh, sleep past 7 a.m., you know, party all night. You think you'll ever find out? Yeah, you know, when, when Hope's grown up. Wow. Wow. What, is, is it really that strange? No, it's, it's just, I mean, I don't know anyone our age who's so settled and responsible. I mean, did you plan this? Oh, hell no. Well, did you ever consider not having the baby or adoption? Yeah, it uh, star one a friend of ours to adopt her, but I always wanted to keep her. You were in high school. I don't know, she's my kid. Sorry for being so nosy. You should be our sociology project. <laughs> no, let's, uh, let's just stick with environmental justice for inner cities. Sure. Um, I looked up some programs that we should include. Great. I wanted to be you and Star. Have a life like this. <laughs> no, it... It isn't Addie. I'm sorry. I got the call just now in the car. The clinic tried to reach you, and they had my number as an emergency backup. Oh, no. No, this is... No. I'm so sorry, Kelly. It's your mom. Linda. She died last night. Oh. Give me your girl. Give me your girl. I'm trying to teach a toddler how to blow her nose, though. That's, that's living the dream? Uh, I didn't think about the nose part, but yeah. When I was in high school, I had a boyfriend. He was it. The one. <laughs> he got accepted to Iowa State, and I wanted to come here. We tried to do the long-distance thing, and then at Christmas, he broke up with me. That's a bummer. Yeah, he wanted to be free. Yeah, and Star, Star and I broke up for a while, and it was hell. Actually, it's the best thing that ever happened to me. This is so sad. Yes, it is. And I know how Kelly feels when I thought it was Mama. Did you call Grandma? I, I got her voicemail, and I wasn't going to leave a message like this over the phone. Just look at Dorian. You know, where is Langston? I'm Mom, I don't know why Langston isn't texting me back. Do you think something happened to her? I'm sure Langston is just fine. What's that supposed to mean? Uh, look at Dorian. She does not need anything to upset her anymore today. What she needs is all of her girls around her. When I was with Jason, I was stuck in high school. I wasn't growing or meeting new people. Oh, is it really different now? 180. I have so many new friends. I'm going to travel over my breaks. Well, that's good. It's, uh, it's working out for you. Excuse me. Oh. Hey, baby, what's up? Really bad news. What, is it Miss Lawrence again? Do you understand? For a minute, I thought that my grandma had died. My mom did, too. She must have been freaked. <sighs> yeah. Well, uh, what do you need? Do you, do you want me to grab her up and come over? Oh, no, it's so cold outside. Look, I'll bundle her up. All right, she'll be fine. All right, you need your family together. Of course I do, but I don't want to spread her germs either. No, we're really okay. All the Kramers are hanging together. You always do. So how's our little princess doing? Uh, fussy, but okay. Hey, call me if you need me. Okay, I will. Hey, I love you. I love you, too. Uh, okay, inner city, um, dream projects, uh, why don't we compare those two in New York City with... <laughs> I'm sorry, again, I was, she's probably 13. Are you sure you don't want to learn keg stands? It might be a little easier. You know, you, uh, you were probably right, but, um, uh, I like this life. I can see that. But the next time we need to work, let's meet at my dorm. My roommate's always at her boyfriend's.
Justin, where were you? Oh, Langston. I'm so sorry. I should have been here. I'm so sorry about your sister. Oh. Hey, Marco, 